to my channel if you are new to my channel hey girl hey make sure you that subscribe button and turn on your notifications girl because you need to be notified every time i upload so you guys today's video is brought to you by divatress.com thank you guys so much for partnering up with me to do this video so i know you guys is favorite on my channel is my hair videos and specifically my crochet videos so i'm like you know what why have i done braidless crochet on my channel yet I don't know like I don't know because y'all know my mom raised my hair for me so this is perfect for when I want to you know slay and I'm not around her whatever so if you don't know how to brace this this is for you it's so easy you can do it so yeah Diva Trust was nice enough to send me six packs of this Ultra Expressions 3C Whirly Loop hair I got, I got this in a color number two and i showed you guys like in depth of what the hair looks like inside the pack and everything they also sent me some gold pieces so i'm like you know what let me do you know a little design in the front and you know, you know use the little gold pieces i really love how this came out um let me just show y'all real quick so i just have it like in this little super loose bun um you can do a ponytail you can leave it all down if you want to but I really like this. It's super cute. Uh, I end up using two packs of this hair. That's it. Two packs. Yeah, you can really slay for the low low. Here's off. We're just gonna get into the video. All right, guys. So to start off, I'm gonna part my hair from ear to ear. And yeah, my hair was not exactly freshly washed. I had washed it like four days prior to this. So if you see any little flakes, girl, just excuse that. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna oil my scalp. You guys will see that. So I did the little side sections because all I did was part those in half. But I have this triangle part right here and y'all see I'm oiling my scalp right here. I will link the oil down below that I'm using. And I'm using my Culture Company Edge Tamer, the best edge tamer in the game. I didn't already told y'all. So now I'm just sectioning this section right here into three parts. I'm gonna do that for both of these middle sections and rubber band those. so now i'm just going to repeat those exact same steps so now you guys see that i have all those sections done so i have six sections in total in the middle part and i'm using this um dark and lovely all natural hair butter to moisturize my hair because this is a protective style so make sure that you are moisturizing your hair before you install any type of hair okay so now i'm gonna take that first section on my right and i'm gonna cross it over to the left second section to make some little crisscross patterns so i'm gonna take that left section cross it over to the second right section and rubber band that and so on and so forth really easy it's probably better seeing it than how i'm explaining it but that's all i did for that Alright, so I'm taking my edge tamer again and just slicking my edges down. So what I'm going to do now is take the front sections and just kind of twist them up and put my hair into a low little bun. Okay, so here's the hair that I'm using. This hair can be purchased on divatress.com. Check my description box for the link to purchase the hair. So this is what it looks like. It's pre-looped and you guys are gonna see I'm sliding that piece that creates the loop off. So each pre-looped piece of hair has four individual pieces inside of it. Okay, so y'all just saw me pull the little loop off here so it's no longer in a loop. So I separated these pieces into two and I'm, there's four pieces that come on each loop, so I'm just separating those four pieces. 
and I'm going to crochet this as normal that I am taking the loops off is because I've done this style on my mom and I um, know that it doesn't work that well when you leave the loops on the hair your style will not last as long because you can't really like knot the hair to lock it in place okay so I'm going I'm not going to crochet any hair on my actual ponytail I'm gonna go all the way around this Okay, so around like the top part of the bun to make sure that it is nice and covered up I'm not going to use single pieces like I was doing all I'm doing is cutting the loop off and then I'm gonna take all four of these pieces and install it around the top area of the bun to make sure that it's covered so I got all four pieces right here y'all see my bun is right here and I'm making sure that it's covered up so I'm just doing that twice. Like that. So I'm gonna go ahead and fill in this piece right here. And then you already know I usually separate. So I've just been like running my fingers through the hair, to separate the curls. And I'm gonna go in and separate some individually. I'm gonna trim it up, you know, add some little gold pieces and finish this off. I went ahead and put my gold pieces on and now I'm taking a wide tooth comb and combing the hair out from the bottom all the way to the root and you guys will see it start to get bigger and fluff up some more and that was the look I was going for and then I didn't want to leave it down I wanted like a cute little half up half down so I just took a rubber band and I'm gonna show you guys you can either leave it down you can leave it in a ponytail or you can put it in like a little loose bun like I did and I'm just trimming off some of the ends to give it a little bit of shape that was pretty much it you guys if you enjoyed this video let me know leave me a thumbs up comment down below if i didn't answer any questions like i said this um hair can be purchased on divatrust.com thank you divatrust again for partnering up with me for this video all right y'all i'll see you in my next one Just wanna see how beautiful you are. You know that I see it. I know you're a star. Where you go, I'll follow. No matter how far. I got the V V S I C E O. Oh, oh, oh. Flow like a cooler. Juice, juice, juice. Blame it on my jeweler.